The South San Francisco Scavengers has been here for 100 years. The reason it was a scavenger is because we separated stuff from the day we started. We started separating cardboard and bottles and rags. This will be the first anaerobic digester that makes a transportation fuel in the United States. We have been switching some of our, our collection vehicles from diesel run vehicles to compressed natural gas. Just switching from diesel to compressed natural gas, you lower your carbon footprint by about 20%. Diesel on a carbon intensity is at 95%. Compressed natural gas is recognized at about 75%. It's cleaner, it's better to use. Using a digest, a methane that's made, or a compressed natural gas that's made from food waste and captured and totally used, we go from a 75% to recognized on the carbon intensity scale of a minus 15. Uh, that's amazing. That's really fun and absolutely uh, back to the future, I guess you could call it. The process of anaerobic digestion is simple. After collection from the residents and the businesses, the material is transported back here where we deposit it in our aeration bay where we introduce a little air to keep it from decomposing and smelling and causing odors for our neighbors, uh, along with where we mix the material for introduction to the bacteria in our digesters. Uh, once in the digester, we close the door, and the bacteria, which there are in tanks underneath the digesters, they are introduced through a sprinkler system. They are no different than the bacteria that are in the stomach of a cow, uh, but they are introduced for 21 days. During this 21 day process, we are making methane. The methane is rising out and being extracted out of the, the digesters, collected, cleaned, scrubbed, compressed, and made available for our equipment, our trucks. We then open the doors, move the material, to, which is now very wet and very heavy. We move the material into uh, another chamber where we introduce a little air to it and dry it out. We take it, load it up into a transport truck and bring it to a composting facility. So now after the basic 30 day process, we have uh, compost, we have methane, and it's a very sustainable product. And it's good for us, it's good for the planet, and it's good for the people we serve. And we're proud and thankful that we get to do this.